Welcome on to Stormbreaker Castle. I'm doing this walkthrough per some of the requests in the Discord, so hopefully everyone has a good time. Yes, this is Stormbreaker Castle, and it's a custom build. And right now we're about to head through the Undercroft. Yes, this is available for Airbnb. And uh, one of the things that we like to showcase, if you look while we're walking through the Undercroft here is all of the spell incantations that have been embedded in the columns so that anyone that stays here is safe. We got you covered from the smallest thing, ants, all the way to dragon breath. And that's part of the reason why the undercroft is so long. So that if a dragon ever did land and try to run through here, they wouldn't make it through following you through the undercroft. They'd get caught and you'd guys be able to quickly take them out. So without any further ado, we're here at the uh, main entrance. And right away, you can see that uh, this thing is mammoth in size. It's over 100,000 square feet. For any of you that were wondering what the size was, if you had parties that you might want to have here, we had people stay here before, famous people actually. Harry Potter and Voldemort at separate times, of course, actually came through. Not the actual actor, but the character themselves. This is the spell Undercroft. This is where we do all of our enchantment for our spells. As you can see, it's an assembly line. You can see the spell mana pumps working there to get the mana in and pump it right into the basin. And then the books are infused. And you can see the, the platinum parchment that we actually use to press out the, the spells on. And we can do everything from the smallest to the largest spell, you name it. We have orders coming in daily. This is just where we get the work done. As you can see, everything is of the highest quality. This is all the clockwork brand that we have here. So it's it's not gonna give out anytime soon. And even if uh, we hit it with a major spell, we've had spells blow up in there before. It's all good, it's heavy duty, it's the best. And then this, what we're standing in front of is our smithy shop. It's a, a full detail fully automated, fully capable smithy shop. And we actually have your attendants here. So you've you've got a, an armorer who can custom fit you for your armor. You got the banker right there. So you need your merchants there to help you get whatever you need. So we are a full service smithy shop here. Again, everything is outfitted and outlined in clockwork uh, brand style items as, as far as the forge. Yes, that's actually currency behind us. We can actually print that out for you if you bring your own bullion. We do have stamping. This is our mall slash vendor area. We've had up to a thousand vendors come in at one time and they all fit, you know, throughout the various halls of, of the castle nicely. So, you know, if you're ever thinking about doing banquets or, you know, symposiums or you know, any types of meetings, you know, with any of your guilds, we've got more than enough space here. Um, yeah. And we have some of the security details relaxed so you can see some of the hidden passageways, like those steps over there. They actually do lead somewhere. We'll come back to those. I just want to walk you through, you know, the the main body of of the first floor. And you can see here's one of our banquet tables over there to the right. And this is our full service kitchen where we also have resources a full merchant slash chef here and yes everything all the food that you see was caught here actually at moon sugar meadows and you know it it there's a plethora of wild game and it's very bountiful so everything is organic everything is fresh so you can get all your meals here and and they're quite affordable as well so we even have our own herbs growing fresh right there the vine right there you can just get it right off the vine so yeah so without any further ado, let me walk you back through here and we'll actually explore those secret stairs that are actually pretty cool. So, yeah, when we had this place built, we, we really wanted to have the actual look and feel, you know, of some of the medieval castles. So we actually built Stormbreaker on an, an old city and that's why the stone is so ancient and looks so nice. Yeah, that's actually a limestone uh, with a granite overlay. So, yes, we have lots of towers here. So, you know, those can also be rented out. But what I want to point out to you 
is the master guest room. This master guest room is actually an apartment and we've actually had people, you know, rent the whole estate just to have party here in this particular room. As you can see, the poison of your choice is, is growing on the vine right there. So, I mean, we've got um, two way portals so you can get in and out really quick. The metals are awesome and precious. That's platinum with gold inserts. Um, the smoke is is actually um, a, it enchanted, so it can be whatever. Again, whatever your poison is, you know, it, it's all there. You know, um, it's a good thing in that when you're out in adventuring and and you need you know to have a place to come and really relax and kick back and feel like a part of home. You know, this is it. Uh, like I said, there's a full bath, full bed. This has two bedrooms. It's got all your entertainment, you know, the, the music boom box there, and then all the enchanted uh, tabloids of the times, you know, and they're full access and the paid subscription, so you don't have to buy anything. Everything is automatically paid through, through the estate. So, yes, you can, you can get your Magicians Weekly, you know, and you can also get your, you know, Sorcerer's, stone and, and all those popular tabloids we have them all right there for your entertainment purposes and then this is your storage yes you know it's 100 percent uh backed everything is insured here so you don't have to worry about losing anything and yes there's pitfalls and, and secret trap doors and all those kinds of things that's your security detail you could activate if you wanted in your stay so yes this is the the master suite that's fully capable of, of taking care of just about uh, whatever your needs might be. So heading back out, we're going to uh, go over to the actual stables. Let's see what I'm forgetting. Oh, there's Bob, our, our practice guy. You know, he, he's supposed to be out on the practice terrain, but he complains that when it rains, it rusts him out. So we let him stand down there so he can be in the grandeur or luxuriness of the, uh, castle is where now we're going to go down to the stables our stables can actually outfit a whole platoon up to one garrison and we have stable hands down here as well so i'll take you down here and uh, here we go yeah there you go wonderful you can see we have a couple of mythical steeds here and uh one of our our resources that's uh actually an armorer but he likes to to feed the the animals, the mounts and livestock. So I'm going to come back here to give you one last look at the castle as a whole. You can see it there. It's just mammoth and a thing of beauty. So thank you for attending today and happy adventuring out there. And yes, a Stormbreaker is available for Airbnb.